Hello and welcome back to my channel, it's Crystal here. So everyone, we've got some trailers to look at. Uh, not just one or two trailers, we've got four trailers to look at because Hogwarts Legacy has released the trailers for all four of the common rooms and I am so excited to have a look at these trailers. I am like so ready for this game. I've been ready for this game for a very long time. I'm a lifelong Harry Potter fan. I love playing the games as you know, a kid and a teenager and I've been waiting for a game like this for quite some time. And the common room trailers are going to be excellent because I absolutely love doing the exploring in the game. It's like one of my favourite things to do, not even doing a mission, just literally like having a nosy around in the castle and on the Hogwarts grounds. And yeah, it's interesting that this was actually released um, yesterday because of course yesterday was the 1st of September which we all know the Hogwarts Express leaves platform 9 and 3 quarters at 11am 1st of September. I think there was like a big event happening yesterday in King's Cross which I didn't go to but yeah so like I am just so ready for this game to come out but first things first we've got the common room trailers to have a look at and I think you can all see which uh, which house I belong to so without further ado let's go straight in check out the trailers. Okay and we're going to start off with Ravenclaw um, for some reason they've released the uh, the common room trailers like separately but we'll start off with Ravenclaw and we'll see the rest afterwards. Oh wow. That is beautiful. I like that fire. It looks really like magical. Like, I can imagine the fire just doesn't stop burning, it's like magic fire or something. Yeah, I think you've got to answer like a riddle or something to get into the Raven Clock on the room, I think. I like how there's like loads of like desks and stuff and just books everywhere. I think it definitely suits Ravenclaw. Oh yeah. Okay, cool. I think it's like a shame that we don't really see Ravenclaw at all in the the movies um, because obviously in the uh, Deathly Hallows um, Harry Potter and Luna Lovegood go into the Ravenclaw common room but we don't see that in the movie do we? I think um, they find the Grey Lady in the tower instead so yeah it's a shame we don't get to see that in the movie so I'm really glad we're getting like clearly a lot of attention to it in the game and uh, the next one we're going to look at is the Gryffindor one Oh yeah. This is really fresh in my head because I went to um, the Warner Brothers Studios in June and they've got like the set of the common room there so all fresh in my head. I got this hat there as well. Caput Draconis. Oh yeah. So much detail as well. Which makes sense because I guess you'll be spending most of the time in there as a Gryffindor, I'm assuming. That knight would scare the crap out of me though. <laughs> that like armoured knight. I wish we could see like the the steps turn into like a slide in the girls um the girls bedroom. Okay, yeah, that was really good. Yeah, again, I think more detail will probably will go into the Gryffindor common room because like I imagine in the game we'll spend most time in the Gryffindor common room and they've got more on the Gryffindor common room as well because it's been in all the movies and there's like so much out there about the Gryffindor common room. So yeah, but I'm really really happy with that. Definitely like a lot of work has gone into that. So I'm looking forward to exploring this common room. Uh, the next one we'll look at is Hufflepuff, I think. Oh, okay. 
Really cozy looking. It reminds me of like, of all the plants of like, the greenhouse. Maybe Professor Sprout like, has been designing it recently or probably just planting loads of stuff. Oh, this is cool. Oh, so that's where it is then, yeah. Okay. Oh, that is really nice. I didn't know what to expect with the Hufflepuff because we don't really like hear about the Hufflepuff common room at all compared to like at least Gryffindor and Slytherin. I know in the books they describe Ra Ravenclaw, but I don't remember hearing much about Griff uh, Hufflepuff. <laughs> really nice. I'll take a nice nap in there, I think. Yeah, that was really good. I didn't have much, um, I wasn't sure what to expect with a Hufflepuff one because we just don't see like the Hufflepuff common room like at all in the movies. I wasn't even sure what the description was like. So yeah, that was really, really good. I really feel like they've put a lot of effort into like all of them that we've seen so far. And I'm saving the best for last, of course. We're going to look at the Slytherin common room now. This one's under the lake, isn't it, I think? If I can remember correctly. I think we all remember when like Harry and Ron sneak in disguised as like Crab and Goyle. I'm not sure I like that or not. <laughs> I really hate snakes, even though I'm a Slytherin, I just I hate snakes. I don't feel this one's as detailed as the other three, but I do really like it. I like the sort of dark, darkness that it's got to it. I can't wait to play this though, seriously. Okay, cool. Yeah, I'm really, really happy with that. I just, I cannot wait to play this game and explore these rooms myself. Like, yeah, I can't wait to have a nosy around like all the common rooms and like properly like look around. And it's so cool getting to see like, particularly Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw because you don't really see like much or read much about those two common rooms. We get a lot of the Gryffindor common room. We've had, you know, some of the Slytherin stuff too. But yeah, like, I'm so excited for this game. I thought it was coming out um, this year, but I did my last reaction to the, like, the Dark Arts trailer. I guess now it's February next year, so just, just making me wait more and more. But yeah, like, I'm really excited for this game. Uh, so me a favour, guys, let me in the comments what you think of these trailers, and if you're excited to play this game. If you enjoy the reaction, please like the video, because it really helps the channel grow. And for more reactions, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel. And that is all for me, so guys, thank you so much for watching.